Hello and welcome back to Battle Tech. How you doing? We are about to get our last bit of morale. Um, all work is complete. Cool. Um, and we're gonna save some money. We're gonna, you know, take some more jobs. Estimated monthly total, so we can go ahead and take normal payouts now for now and till forever, because. We're about to get our 50th morale, so we can stand to lose a bunch before, uh, you know, before we have to do another payout like that. Um, we don't have to wait for that, though. We can do a contract. Um, War Council. We could do Witness Protection. What is that? Escort. Hate that. Hate that. It is a good payout, I won't lie. Um... Four, I've never taken anything as difficult as four stars. So it's a little bit spicy. But let's let's take it. Um, I actually kind of like the default pay. Three of 13. That means if we manage to kill a mech, uh, with, you know, like a, a really good mech, then um, we could take all of its parts. This is going to be spicy. I'm going to do a pause here so you don't have to w watch this. And never mind, the literal next second was a uh, event. Raised voices echo down the mess hall, uh, uh, deck hallway, and you arrive to find Medusa nose to nose with Decker. I don't care about your noble, f uh, noble family. You don't give me orders, Medusa snarls, poking the other mech warrior in the chest with each word. Decker lifts his chin. Even out here in the periphery, you should know enough to listen to your betters. Medusa's fist flashes out before anyone can intervene, sending Decker staggering, blood erupting from a broken nose. In the dangerous silence that follows, the room finally notices that you've arrived. Uh, I'd say punish them both, yeah. I, I, I get it. Medusa is, you know, not wrong for being angry, but he is wrong for throwing a punch. So... Decker and Medusa will both be unavailable and they both get low spirits, but the morale is not lost and that's good. The following day, when you arrive in the barracks, both mech warriors are calmer and properly ashamed about their confinement to quarters. Pointing to Decker, I don't care about your noble upbringing. I should know better than anyone how little that matters out here in the periphery. And Medusa, I don't care if he's a pompous jerk. You can't start fights in the mess hall. This is all correct, I think. Looking both of them in the eyes we're in a dangerous business we need to be able to trust each other and if a mech gets damaged from a friendly fire incident on the next contract you'll both be out on your asses uh yeah i i agree um let me see well they'll be back before we even get to weldry so it's hard it hardly matters all right, so we got 50 morale. I don't seem to be getting an achievement for that. So we pay, we bought it for nothing. That's okay, though. I don't mind. We have 50 morale, and that's still worth something. All right, I'll do a pause. All right. We have, we have arrived, maybe. Well, we have eight more days, but that'll be over before we know it. So we're going to be taking a fairly difficult mission. I actually kind of worry about this. Um, but we have rearmed all of our mechs. So they should be better equipped. Um, this is actually not a bad setup. I like this a lot. Yeah, this is good. I, I'm, I'm a little bit worried. This is this is going to be spicy. But at least it's on a Tundra planet, so we don't have to worry too much about heat. All right, BRB. All right. Here's, here's hoping that this doesn't go horribly awry. I'd like to bet that it doesn't. I think it's going to be fine. We have friendly units in danger, Commander. Move to intercept them and provide support. Get them to safety. Keep them intact and get... Uh, is this a... This is a convoy. No! Why did I take this? Why did I take this mission? Why? On my way. Did I like I, I did I like look at that mission and I was like I don't want to take that and then I looked saw it again and just saw the dollar signs and nothing else and I was like, "Yep. 
This is fine. My God. Convoy. <sighs> I fully expect to fail this mission. I'm receiving word from the convoy. You've secured the area around their position and they are making their way towards the extraction point now. Keep them alive. Keep in mind that the convoy will try to stay near you for protection. Continue advancing to get them to the extraction point. Yeah, I tried that last time. It didn't work too well. Is that the extract? Oh god, it's it's a really long extraction point. Also, the vehicles might be faster than me. Yeah, they're kind of faster than me. On the move. Got it. They also spawned like ahead of me towards the evac. So I hate these missions. I really truly hate them. They're just not very well designed for this game. I don't like being responsible for much stupider, smaller, squishier, you know, metal things. Can we do a jump down? Oh God, no, we can't. We can only sprint. Like, I'll try my best to keep up. Oh, we can actually do a jump. Okay. That might help a little bit if we have a mech closer, but like they keep gaining ground on us. They're also taking up a lot of the road. Enemy turn. So the, we are close to the enemy now. We are kind of gaining ground. Okay. I think we might be able to catch up. We just need to be ahead of them. At least best case scenario amongst, well, not best case scenario. Um, at the very least, we need to be amongst the targets that they are, you know, in and around. Okay, so here are our mechs. Standing by. I'm going to actually reserve the behemoth on the off chance we can actually take a shot with it. Order. Can we take a shot with it? Doesn't look like it. So I'm going to continue sprinting forward. I love that the uh, Highlander has pauldrons. Like imagine pauldrons that are as big as your like is a is a skyscraper, you know? Confirmed. We got our first sight. We've got a dragon. Go ahead and lob everything. Might keep the uh, crab in the water along with the marauder actually. I'm already liking the setup for the crab a lot more. Before I, like, I couldn't keep it. It would have overheated in the water. So though we didn't uh, knock it over, that was pretty good. Oh, I, the, and the little vehicles are going to hit it as well. We have an Orion. I don't think I've ever seen an Orion before. It's a heavy. I'm gonna sprint because I, I really like these vehicles are still moving, which is really annoying. <laughs> The vehicles are being useful. They they are actually doing something, but like they probably can't take even two hits. Receiving you. Okay, here's our opportunity to do something really. What is a cataract? What a cataf cataphract. Cataphract. Huh. Okay, we could potentially one-shot the Orion here, given enough luck. Okay, 
it does have some armor on the head so we're gonna have to hit it with like both ppcs or a ppc and a medium laser Whoa! yo your heavy mech is nothing nothing before my might Good lord, that is so nice. That is so nice. So the crab is out of water. And that's not good for a crab, you know? A crab, it likes to be in the water. We hit the head. Waiting for orders. Uh... Let's uh, continue hitting that dragon. Tell me what to do. Can't believe it's not knocked over. It's on unsteady, un unsteady ground, and it's like well past the the point, right? Now they just need to shoot a couple of these vehicles, and they probably will. Only thing I'm kind of worried about is that catara uh, cataphract. On my way. Uh, we can hit that dragon pretty hard. Targeting for an alpha strike. That's pretty good. Pilot injured. Reporting can probably kill that thing without damaging the mech too much. We're going to be able to get a full Orion. I don't even know what an Orion is. I am just so stoked about that. That is so good. These vehicles insist on being like really viable targets. <laughs> Don't mind me and my alarm. Good. Uh, I'm very optimistic right now. Let's try and uh, take out the cataract. Cataphract? I really want to say cataract, but it's a cataphract. Confirmed. Well, we hit the head. We didn't. We didn't uh, kill it, but I, I, you know, we get, we killed the Orion in one Orion. shot. Come on, it's it's still. I I still consider this amazing. Okay, that's the uh, dragon dead. And stay down. Can we? We can still hit stuff while we're in the water. We don't actually have to leave right now. We can also just use the LRMs. That's why we have them. We'll reduce all of our uh, heat by doing this. Um. Yeah, I'm not going to go for a uh, precision shot. I'm just going to hit it. We should still kill it. Nope, that's okay. I'm cool with that. Now, we don't want to we don't want to let the vehicles get too far ahead because there might still be more. I'm a little worried that these things will try and do a melee hit. They're doing me a huge favor and like not attacking the vehicles right now. We can't do a multi-hit, unfortunately, so I'm just going to try and kill this Enforcer. Acknowledged. We knocked it over. That's something. These vehicles are getting, like, way too ahead of themselves. Oh, they actually killed something. That's kind of nice. That does actually save me uh, an attack. What's up, boss? Okay. Can we uh, take out the cataphract? Yeah. Come on. Yes. Yes. PPC crit. Go 
We can move through the rough terrain. Unless something else shows up, we should be okay. I feel like I've trivialized this game a little bit. In a good way, but I, like I'm enjoying it. I don't even care if it's easy or Let's make our way over there with a the crab. We'll uh, make our way through the rough terrain. This is the one mech that can jump. I'm sure all convoy units survive during the extraction. Is there anything else? I mean, they threw some pretty beefy mechs at us. But uh, I managed to just like completely stomp them. I'm glad that we actually do have some speed. I love those pauldrons. They're a little bit war Warhammer for my taste, but I, I, I do think that they're really fun. More contacts on the sensors, Commander. Looks like they're sending in units to hunt and destroy our employers' peoples. Employers' people. So they are pretty much all there now. They, oh, that last one just barely didn't make it. That's fine. Um, we have a huge advance on whatever is making its way over here. Here comes the drop ship. Hopefully that last vehicle um, makes its way in there. Is there anything super... Okay, we got a 45. I mean, like, that's not really much to worry about. I'm actually going to reserve the behemoth. We'll do a jump. We'll do a sensor lock. Um, I guess on the 55. I've got a sensor lock. It's a griffin. Nothing too much to worry about. We can hit it with a crab, probably. Yeah, we can. Look at this absurd range. I love it. It's just amazing. What did it, it shoot through the mountain? I don't expect to get another headshot before the uh, the session is over, and I honestly don't want these mechs, like whatever they are. They're probably going to throw an extraction point for us. Are they actually in the thing now? Good. Cool. So now they will throw an evac zone to us, which is where? Hello? Okay. All right. It's we're actually heading in the right direction. I guess we will have to kill these guys. I mean, this, it's going to be easier than just like going to the zone. We have two more mechs over here. Oh, what do you mean a 70 ton? Commander. Damn. Not a great idea to reveal the Marauder because then everything can hit her. But let's just try and take something out, make it worth it. Ugh. Hit it, but did not kill it. I feel like I've made a terrible mistake. Oh, well, maybe not. Can we hit the griffin? We can hit the griffin. It only needs to be, like, sneezed on, and then the head's dead. We did hit the head. It's still alive, though. Commander? Is 
60 ton and a 70 ton. I'm not comfortable even the Highlander taking the brunt of all of that. Firing on target. Truly amazed that it's still alive, actually. It took... It, it, the, the pilot has taken, I think, like four ticks of damage. So what do we got over there? A quick draw. That's fine. Waiting for orders. Okay, um, four health left. Come on. Roger. Seriously? My God. Oh my God. Is it going to get up and still do stuff? Ah. This griffin has taken so many. This is the downside. We're seeing the downside of going for the head. Orders. Meanwhile, um, you know, the sniper has got new, new prey. Locking in all we did not hit it. This is fine. I'm honestly totally fine. Notice I'm not even ba uh, bothering with the blackjack. Good to go. <sighs> right, Let's man. um, can we can we kill something? We should just be able to take this out. Right, there we go. That's a kill. Not sure what I hit there to kill it, but I don't care. Really want to get the crab like in there. I can't believe this thing can jump. Crabs can jump, yo. It can't really like, it's it's so slow that it can't really do anything but lob more uh, rockets. We're not going to be able to extract. We're we're going to have to like do this the slow way. Damn. It recovered all of its stability. Um, We can just, you know, like, we don't have to... We're just going to be shooting them. I mean, like, there's really not much else for us to do. We can sh hit that Warhammer. Oh, uh, if I could get a headshot on the Warhammer, I might trade the Orion for the Warhammer. Not sure. That's fine. We have something to shoot at. We we're taking some hits on the Battlemaster. Okay, here we go. Can we get another amazing headshot? From like our, you know, best player, basically. Come on. That, does, that did not look good. Did not look good. I mean, it had evasion, unfortunately. I'm gonna keep trying though. If I get a headshot on the uh, the war master or war warhammer, um, we Honestly, will get a it. full warhammer mech. Are we breached? Oh no, the battle master is breached. Let's try and take out that quick draw. Wow. That is a lot of hits it just took. Let's continue hitting it. Come on, not fall over. There we go. There we go. Pilot injured. Is it gonna get back up? No, that's the Warhammer doing stuff. I won't lie, the Battlemaster's taking some nasty damage right now. But it is overheating. That's good. Okay, we... What's on our left arm? Just a PPC? We can afford to lose that. I'm not too bummed about that. However, our our right torso does have quite a lot of damage. So I don't want to lose that. Um, I'm going to... I'm actually going to back up for now. 
just for now we'll come back you know it's not uh, the end of the world marauder can take a hit we don't need to um waste a called shot i think we get one for free no we don't okay come on let's get that warhammer oh we are gonna overheat shoot this is the weapon accuracy plus six accuracy plus three accuracy let's hit them with the plus three three or plus 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 i guess Firing on yes Warhammer! Let's just um, dedicate a, an attack to, to kill in that quick draw before it gets back up. Done. And now the poor little blackjack is all on its own. Yeah, and then look, we'll we'll come back around and uh, finish it off with the battle master. We knocked it over. That hit something good. It's gonna get back up. No, it's not. Standing by. May as well. Engaging with target. There we go. <clears throat> Easy. Kind of wish I'd gone for parts on this mission rather than uh, money. Actually, like at all. Like I wish I'd forgone money completely. But I guess I did say like I don't know how many more mechs I'm gonna want. I've got a pretty good team. At this point, I'm collecting for the sake of collecting. We did get a pretty good payout. We'll have to do some repairs, but they will definitely be covered no one got injured is the best news all right so we've got a 70 ton cataphract and a 75 ton orion and a 70 ton warhammer the warhammer is four lasers for support it's got pretty good movement for a heavy um, the Orion is four lasers and two missiles. Very good melee. Like, ridiculously good melee. I guess they're all pretty good melee. So, I mean... Objectively, I would probably go for the Orion. Four lasers is pretty good. <clears throat> Brawler and close assault. Its movement isn't bad. Um, cataphract is also an option. Well, we got headshots on all of the heavy tanks. Cataphract is five lasers. It's also a brawler and close assault. Um, well, I mean, between two brawler and, and close assault, I'd probably take the Orion. And what about the uh, Warhammer? It's just a brawler. Hmm. I mean, we could take the Warhammer and go brawler with it. That'd be kind of fun. Often found in the thick of combat, hurling PPC bolts at its foes. It's not the most heavy armored brawler, but it tends to give at least as good as it gets, especially with any energy based weapons. Orion is a slow, yes, but powerful. Plenty of armor. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, the Orion seems good. Call uh, the Cataphract the uh, Franken-Mech, because it's got a little bit of everything stitched together on it. The 1X model works well at medium, long, to close range, with good armor and weaponry. Okay. Um, it's not very heat efficient. I'm, like, very hardcore deliberating right now um i'm just gonna take the orion do we have any warhammer part we actually do have warhammer parts kind of a bummer but that's fine we might get some warhammer parts 
We got a Warhammer part, so we're actually two parts towards a Warhammer. We could potentially buy the last one. I mean, at this point, I mean, like I could build some of my money, you know, some money and then like buy some really decent weaponry, but we've got a pretty top of the line lance at this point. Um, so I'm not sure what we're going for next. I think honestly, I might start just like powering through the campaign a little bit. Um, definitely. I want to build up some more money. It was the first true heavy mech mercenaries have gained some experience. Uh, let's have a look at that first. We at this point have quite a bit of flexibility. We can increase their health. Oh, and it also increases their overheat threshold. That's actually really good for her. Same with big, simple. Um, we could uh, improve his health. Decker wasn't in that mission. Glitch, what do you got? Um, I don't know what you've been in, but let's improve your health. Always a good idea. Um, we're waiting on that last bit of tactician. Cool. So let's look at our bay. We've got the king, Highlander. We got uh, we got to do some repairs on the battlemaster. Twenty thousand, not not nothing too bad. We're gonna shelf the 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 two dragons. They're like maybe backup. I like how the, <laughs> the I know it's a little bit different, but. It, the Orion's short form kind of looks like oink to me. <laughs> it's an onik. Um, okay, so we need to refit the Orion. The Marauder is still good. The Marauder is doing so well for us. Can we have a look at the store and see if there's a Warhammer part in there? It's the only thing I'm like, it'd be kind of nice to get a Warhammer. We could buy an awesome part. Uh, not seeing a Warhammer part. I will actually buy this awesome part. Because the uh, awesome is still an 80 ton mech. It's, it's quite good. Um, do we have any contracts we can take here? We've got some, like, high tier ones. We've got a battle on a tundra. That seems good. So, let's go ahead and equip the... Orion. It's a 75 ton. So I actually think it would be better off. Like, I'll just leave it for now. Might end up selling it. But I like what we've got going on. I like the Marauder. And I uh, would prefer not to mess with things too much. So we'll wait two days. Your actions against our interest are Earning you a powerful enemy commander. Continue to impede Torian operations in this region and you will pay the cost. It's fine. Alright, so let's take on another mission. I'm not sure, again, I'm not sure what kind of mechs we're hoping for. Uh, flushing them out seems like a good pay. Four of 19 or one million. Uh, I wish it was three of 11. If we come across an awesome, I'll be glad that I took one cherry pick. All right. So this is going to do it for uh, this this episode. Um, like, this will be the last mission of the episode, obviously. So apparently we're dropping down with a five-tier uh, mech lance. I didn't realize how, like, over-prepared I was for these missions. So, yeah, I, I definitely want to... I want to do a little bit of sandboxing just to get the, you know, some extra money, fully upgrade the Argo, um, mostly for achievement stuff, to be honest. And um, then we can start doing the campaign. I mean, I, the only thing left, like I say, is to get some more weapons. That's really the only thing I am kind of lacking in is like 
really decent weapons like some stuff has it like obviously the marauder is well equipped but it would be nice to have the highlander have like a bunch of plus plus weapons or something a bit more exotic let's keep our eyes peeled commander this feels like a trap it always feels like a trap is it is it a trap if you always know it's a trap I guess it is, you know. A trap that you spring yourself is still a trap. No point in trying to do anything else here. We can only sprint. That's a 90 ton mech. 90 tons. What could that be? What is that? 75 tons. Jesus. We actually have kind of a shot on it. We could take it. Location confirmed. That is a, a marauder. Look at that. Taking the shot. I think it's funny that the 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 mech itself kind of uh, reels. Oh, there's another mech over there. We did hit the head. We really need to like hit it with both PPCs in order to destroy the head. So it's a it's a fairly low chance. Like it's a 35% chance to hit the head. Um, which is, you know, not great odds. I mean, we have to hit it twice. Those look like really good hit hits. I'm amazed it didn't Hit, destroy the head, the head honestly marauders taking some nasty hits Ready for orders. we don't i don't like care to try and kill it in one hit tbh because like i don't need another marauder but, but you know like killing it on the first turn uh you know oh lance command mod I guess that mar mar Marauder is the same as the one I've got. It's got some uh, weirdo tech. That's fine. Ready for orders. Let's just try and get the kill here. Pilot injured. Still not dead, though. Take that. That's really not good. I needed it to die. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Was that a PPC? It kind of looked like one. <clears throat> Damage is minor, Commander. Okay, I need you to die, actually. Still not dead. What, Amazing. Huh? A 90 ton it's mech is also a problem. Fire. Like, I have very much taken for granted that there's just a 90 ton mech sitting around. What is that? A Cyclops? Oh, heck yeah, I want a Cyclops. Okay, I'm actually going to reserve. Let's just do an attack on the Marauder. I need, I want a Cyclops. Look at that thing. Ouch. Okay, we got pretty good. Oh, that's a Zeus. Like we got some really chunky mechs here. Locking in all weapons That's that's not great, dude. Those are not good hits. Stop aiming at the Marauder. No, well, that's that's my pilot injured. We're gonna sprint over because I wanna try and hit that cyclops on my way double time warning armor low okay um i'm going to make a choice here and try to just kill the zeus rather than trying to like get all of the salvage from it i know it's a nice mech but i'd rather have the cyclops 
<clears throat> we are going to overheat, so I have to hold back a bit of our firepower. I guess they're all in forest right now, which kind of sucks for us. Um, I'm gonna continue trying to hammer the Zeus. Here we go. Another hit like that and you're choked. Okay, I'm gonna move up a little bit so I can I have a better chance of hitting it with the medium laser. This is a kind of our short range. Mm, we're gonna have to <clears throat> hold back the PPC. Really wish we could have knocked it over. Okay, what was that? Our crab? We have a thunderbolt? Okay, can we hit the cyclops? Yes, we can. We've got a good chance of, of doing this. We hit it, but we didn't destroy it. We really need to hit the head with the PPCs. Oh, no! No! Oh, God. Well, they did it. They, they did it. They took out my sniper. That's Behemoth dead. Oh, my God. Oh, that sucks so much. Um, yeah, I mean, unless I lose Big Simple, which I'm not going to throw the match. I, I, I have just lost one of my best mechs. I lost my best mech and uh, one of my best pilots. Right, Still trying to get the Cyclops. I mean, I need to replace the Marauder with something now, right? Oh, that really sucks. I've been getting, I've had such a good, like, line of luck that, you know, it had to end at some point, right? I don't like her voice. It's really weird to me. Don't want to lose another mech also. Ace pilot, huh? Uh, we do have enough for another precision. I, I, I'm still trying to take out the Cyclops. I mean, no one else... We, we did do it. We, we incapacitated the, the Cyclops. This is good. Okay, now we need to like kill what's left on the field, which is quite a lot, unfortunately. Got it. Commander, that's a critical hit. Our left arm is damaged, so this should be good, especially if we can kill this thing. In a rare act of me trying to actually like play tactically and get get behind a mech didn't actually do much because we haven't done much to the back right so it still had armor 80 damage melee hit I'm under heavy fire. yeah i know internal structure damage coordinates received what can we hit here not wow it's it's actually quite well, we'll try and uh, hit the leg. 
That looks really good. Yeah, left leg destroyed. Critical hit, Commander. We can start hitting the uh, Zeus. We have too much heat built up, so let's um, let's try and just kill like the Thunderbolt. I don't mind. They, they have, haven't really done much damage to the King Crab, so this is fine. I just kind of want to, like, just stomp the Thunderbolt. There we go. Head destroyed. Perfect. Okay, let's try and hit the Zeus with, like, everything. Oh, I guess we don't have that luxury. We can hit it with a large laser. Let's do a precision shot. Try and, uh, I guess we'll try and hit the leg to knock it over. Good to go. So yeah, I mean, much to my chagrin, um, there isn't, a, there's, there's no lucky hit here. Uh, in terms of like, they aren't going to kill Big Simple, so I, I've lost Behemoth and I've lost the Marauder. This is a this is a loss. Make no mistake, it sucks. All out of LRM, Commander. Really? You're out of ammo? I mean, I guess that makes sense. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll just hit it. I, that, <laughs> I mean, I guess I better get used to it because, uh, Mandrake's going to be going on a lot more missions now. Yeah, this is fine. We can do a precision. Uh, let's just hit the torso. Really? It's still alive, huh? Well, the Highlander... Oh, yeah, it's, it's out of ammo. I thought maybe it, like, got hit at some point, but it didn't. We, we knocked it over. Always sucks when that's, like, the last turn. Unless, I guess, someone uh, has good initiative, but no. They didn't have an... Uh, it was, it was like our last turn and they had yet to move so they get to get up and do some stuff. Just, just kill it. Nope. We can probably kill it with precision shot. Gonna take off our large laser. There we go. Uh, I wonder if we get to keep our Marauder. Like, you know, it might might be that it's like severely damaged, but like, do we not get to keep the, the what's left and make repairs on it? Or is it just salvage at this point? Ugh. Killed. Damn. Uh, we only get one part. <laughs> well, I'll take a Cyclops part. Yeah, we. I guess we get a Marauder part. Yay. Uh, that's just like... That couldn't feel much worse, to be honest. We, considering that that mech had like done so much and killed so many other mechs, it's it's just it sucks so much to see it uh, die. And I don't know if we get to keep it. 
I still don't know. They, they, they haven't really made that clear yet. We'll see. Behemoth has died. Confirm. We're going to need to do some mech repair. Yeah, I know. Our mechs are gaining experience. That's fine. This is all very bittersweet. Um, so we do have the Marauder. In fact, it's not even a huge expense to repair it. So that's quite nice. Uh, it's, you know, we can replace the pilot, I suppose. Replacing the Marauder is more difficult in some ways. Um, and we didn't lose any of the, like, fairly expensive weaponry on it. So, yeah, I mean, like, not, not awful. I just, uh, Behemoth, losing Behemoth is, sucks. Especially since we were, like, very, like, we, we had basically maxim, like, max, uh, leveled them up. Still, we can max level up someone else. You know, Mandrake is, is getting pretty good in, with tactics, so, like, they could jump in that mech, maybe. But, uh, at this point, I'd, I think I'd prefer to try and save for something beefier. Um, you know, we've done really good with that thing, but, um, I, I think we, we should consider looking at a Cyclops or, you know, another 90 to 100 ton mech. Uh, who else went on that glitch? Glitch, you can take some piloting. As well. Big Simple can take some more guts. Bug has a bunch of XP that I have y haven't spent. Okay, well, let's have a quick look at the store. I'm surprised we don't, like, lose morale, honestly. My morale is lost. Okay, there's nothing here we can buy. Um, so we're going to go ahead. I'm not sure where our next mission is. So what I'm going to do is try and see if I can find the next campaign mission. Travel contact. Um, we're here. Uh, not sure where Weldry is. Is it there? Where's Weldry? Panzer. Mictor. Umgard. Smithen. I, I wish that they made this easier for me, honestly. Uh, store filter. Battlefield advance. Chemical. Okay, that's interesting. I didn't even know that this was a thing. So, like, we could, uh, look for, like, Star League level gear. Um, interesting. But, I, I guess I'm just gonna make for my next campaign. Which is, uh... Oh, are we already here? I guess we are here. Um... Where are we? <laughs> Seems like a stupid question. I I can't even tell. I guess we're, we must be on Weldry? Good lord, why is this so difficult? Why why are, like, interfaces such a challenge? We are on Weldry. Okay, so we shouldn't move from here. Okay, well, um... The only thing I could say is that we could take another mission um, that offers parts like, um, uh, like retribution, um, and try our best to, um, get some cyclone parts, Cy cyclops parts. I don't know why, I, where cyclone came from. It's a been, it's been a long day. Um, but you know, we'll, we'll see. I think that that's the only thing I could possibly do before I do our, our next campaign mission. So we might do that on the next episode. Uh, if you are enjoying the series, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.